But I've experienced this kind of thing before, and generally, as these things mount up, it, it, it takes a, a, a pretty good toll, and I suspect that we're going to see this toll be taken here in the next, next week or so. It's been a little bit more than a week since the accusations first came out, reported first by Politico. But Alex, he's raised more than $2 million in this week. Uh, that's almost as much as he raised in weeks and weeks uh, going into, the, uh, into this a accusation. So financially and in terms of poll numbers, he seems to be weathering it, le at least so far. You know, until this point, Wolf, that's right. He framed this as a debate really between Herman Cain and the news media. Pick which one you believe is telling the truth. Well, he can't do that anymore. Now there's, there's a witness out there. There's human evidence. And, uh, and it's much more difficult. I think you could say today that the Michael Jackson jury found Herman Cain guilty in the court of public opinion today. The dots now, you don't have to connect them. They're beginning to connect themselves. And this is a blow to the campaign. I talked to the Herman Cain campaign actually this morning, and they weren't uh, expecting this. They were, they were talking about how they're going to move on to the next chapter, get back to policy uh, and, uh, and tax cuts and those kinds of things. So I think now, clearly, this is something they're going to have to address, uh, which is not what they've been expecting to do. I disagree with James. There was a path for a Herman Cain, but I think right now it's much more difficult James's point, I think, is dead on, which is you can't have as a campaign slogan, everybody's lying but me. And at some point where there's just too much of this, it begins to create a pattern that tells you something about the character of a candidate. And people begin to look at it and say, well, wait a minute, uh, even if I believe him, I'm not sure that others will in a general election against Barack Obama. So this is at a serious point now. And, uh, and I think what Cain is doing, saying, hey, I'm just going to ignore this. This is an evil conspiracy against me. That's not going to get him there. Yeah, well, we'll see what happens.